okay so good evening guys so this video is all about the reviewer for your video recitation next week on um, May I think it's May 25 okay, it's May 25 and May 27 so this would be a review for your subject CS1 OP. So if you have some questions or if you want to ask something about your date or something, you can email me in a at gmail.com. Okay? So this is all about some questions I'm going to ask you on Tuesday and Thursday. So hoping guys that you're going to review this uh, presentation. Okay? Let's start now. So the first question is blank is used to open a file in Python. It's mainly required two arguments, first the file name and then file opening mode. So the answer is open, open and close parentheses function. Okay. The next one is it is used to exit a while loop or a for a loop. It terminates the looping and transfer execution to the statement next to the loop. So the answer is break statement. Elif or else if is a keyword used in Python. Replacement of else if to place another condition in the program. This is called the chain conditioner. The next one is, it consists of Boolean expression which the souls has, are either true or false, followed by one or more statements. The answer is, if statements. Blank is a program are used when the program has conditional choices to execute a formula. The answer is, decisions. Next, blank are defined in the same way as this. So the answer is tuples. The next one is the blank are containers that hold some other objects in a given order. So the answer is this. Next, blank comment is useful when we need to comment on many lines. The answer is multi-line. Next is a single line comment begins with a blank symbol and is useful in mentioning that the whole line should be considered as a comment until the end of the line. The answer is hashtag symbols. Next is blank is a programming language that include features of C and Java. It provides the style of writing an elegant code like C. And for object-oriented programming, it offers classes and objects like Java. So the answer is Python. It provides coding assistance and analysis with code completion project and code navigation, integrated unit testing, version, control integration, debugging, and much more. So the answer is PyCharm. Next, blank means many forms that is, that is a thing or action is present in different forms or ways. The answer is polymorphism. Next, this property allows us to hide the details and expose only the essential features of a concept or objects. The answer is abstraction. Next, blank is a very useful from a code to the use perspective. So the answer is inheritance. Next, this property hides unnecessary details 
and makes it easier to manage the program structure. So the answer is encapsulation. Next, Python, an object-oriented programming or OOP, is a way of programming that focuses on using blank and blank to design and build application. So the answer is object and classes. Next, what is the error of the code below? What is the error of the code below? Name is equals to input employee name. So the answer is open and close curly braces. Next, what is the error of the code below? Hours is equals to positive input, enter number of hours. The answer is, the error is positive. What is the error of the code below? Text 1 is equals to F rendered hours, hours, printed F text 1. So the answer is, the error of this code is print F. What is the error of the code below? Sample text 1A is equals to sample text 1 underscore format SSS comma, pill health comma, housing loan comma, text comma, the transaction those phrases so the answer is sample text one dot format what is the error of the code below print open bracket total salary php comma net of uh, closing curly braces the answer is open bracket and close curly brace that is the error. What is there of the code below? That reverse string. There is that D E F F should be only one F. Next, what is the error of the code below? String is equals to joint reverse string. You should put the open and uh, the close brace. Now the next one. What is the error of the code below? Print the length of the string is length name. So the error is comma. After the double quote, you should put the comma. Okay. The next one is blank is an online compiler and debugger told for C and C++, Python, PHP, Ruby, C Sharp, BB, Perl, Swift, Prolog, JavaScript, Pascal, HTML, CSS, JS, Code, Compile, Run, and Debug online from anywhere in world. So the answer is GDB online. Online GDB. What is the output of the following code? This program adds two numbers. Number one is 1.5, number two is 6.3. You're going to add two numbers. Sum number one plus number two. Display the sum. The sum of number one and sum of number two is so format num one and num two sum. So the answer is the output is the sum of 1.5 and 6.3 is 7.8. What is the output of the code below? A is equal to 5. Print the value of A is A. So the output is the value of A is 5. What is the output of the code below? So we're going to reverse the string. Join the reverse string. You're going to join all of this reverse string. Then input the uh, enter name. Then the reverse string using reverse is then reverse name offer going to up the capitals the letter then going to uh, count the length of the string so the output is enter name sample case then the reverse string using reverse is a card and the length of the string grace is five so that is the output of this code below what is the output of the code below 
name is equals to input what is your name what's your name print hello name so what's your name sample grace then the output is hello grace what is the output of the code below print one two three four print one two three four sep meaning separate four of this as the uh, asterisk then print one two three four separator as hashtag then put the end of the uh, what do you call that end sign so this will be the output one two three four one uh star two three four then one two three four which has a hashtag and and last thing what is that with the code below so class cell phone color is the blue model manufacturer samsung okay iphone of or b boy real me they're going to print the color print the model print the manufacturer and the output is the color is gray okay the model is uh, for the manufacturer is of uh, the color is blue the model is real me and the manufacturer is electronic preparation so this is the output of the code below then blank help break our program into smaller and modular chunks the answer is functions keywords blank that marks the start of the function header the answer is def def that's the keyword for the function define function or def what is output the code below so program to find the sum of all numbers stored in the disk this of number is 6, 5, 3, 8, 4, 2, 5, 4, 11. Variable to store the sum is equals to 0. Iterate over the list for value is number sum plus ball is the sum is sum. So the sum is 48 of those particular list number. Then um, blank is a name given to entities like class, function, variables, etc. It helps to differentiate one entity from another. So the answer for this is identifier. Blank are special symbols in Python that carry out arithmetic or logical computation. So the answer is operators. Blank are used to perform mathematical operations like addition, subtraction, multiplication, etc. So the answer is arithmetic operators. Next, blank are used to compare values. It returns either true or false according to the conditions. So the answer is comparison operators. The next question, what is the shortcut keys in running PyCharm? So the answer is Alt Shift plus F10. The ifs else statement evaluates test expression and will execute the body of if only when the test condition is blank so the answer is true a blank is a blueprint for the object so the answer is class blank are function defined inside the body of the class and the answer is methods Object-oriented programming makes the program easy to understand as well as efficient. So that is the answer, efficient. Blank are name, location, and disk to store related information. So the answer is files. What is the output of the code below? Num is equal to float, input, enter a number. If num is a greater than equal to zero, if number is equal to zero, print zero else print positive number else print negative numbers uh, enter the number five positive number program to iterate through a list of using indexing generate spark rock jazz iterate over the list using index for i is in range then generate print i like general so i like pop i like rock i like just so that is the that's all for your uh, question for your uh, data dissertation on Tuesday and Thursday. Thank you very much. This is your instructor, Imam Base. Have a Just message me in my email address if you have some question again. Rainido1980 at gmail.com. Thank you very much. God bless, guys. Bye.